The next generation of plumbers, printers and everything in between descended on Showgrounds Park Event Centre last week for the inaugural Game of Life event. There was a lot of um, planning involved and surveying. Um, so yeah, it's super cool to see it actually up off the ground. Over 1,000 students from the Gisborne region came in waves over six hours to explore the jobs and opportunities on offer here in Gisborne. The event was a chance to change the students' perception that most opportunities were outside Gisborne. More than 70 employers, from infrastructure to the creative industries, signed up to the event with businesses getting interactive to grab students' attention. What we're about is we recruit people who want to come into the transport industry uh, and then we train them and then we talk about retaining, meaning training, if you come in with a class one license, we'll help you to get up to a, a class two license and then follow you through, right through to your class four. I've been saying to the girls today, if you're really passionate about helping people feel good about themselves, and if you have a passion for sciences, then this is definitely a career for you. Definitely been a lot of interest today, um, particularly from girls who are really interested in like skin health, and of course, eyebrows and eyelashes are such a hit at the moment. So yeah, there's definitely been a lot of interest in beauty therapy, and in particular, being able to offer an apprenticeship program in Gisborne, because otherwise you have to travel outside of the region to become qualified. Um, and it's the same qualification, NZQA Level 4 in Beauty Therapy. Dr Matthew McDonald from Matai Research said it was awesome to expose students to the possibilities in Gisborne. Uh, the beautiful thing about Matai is that we're multidisciplinary. So we're a research institute driven by our MRI scanner here in Gisborne, Tarafiti, uh, which brings together disciplines all over health sciences, from engineering to uh, computer technology uh, to medicine, and uh, to community stakeholders as well. But not all jobs require a degree with student debt. Representatives from builders to barbers were showing students they could walk straight into a job as well as a paycheck. How's it? I'm Reef and I'm a barber. And we got a salon side here today too. It's about new to meeting new people and just love making my clients happy, eh? Seeing them smile after the cut. It's a real happy place to be in a barber shop. Karen Fenwick of Trust Tide Afferty's License to Work program said the event was a huge success. 